The next topic we're going to focus on relates to um, functions of the skeleton, and that falls under the physical and mental um, capacity aspect, B453. Um, so, as we can see from this uh, image here, essentially five functions of the skeletal system and you can draw upon any one of these when you're answering an exam question. A typical question might be, um, describe the functions of the skeletal system and it's important that you're able to draw upon these areas. So, one by one, shape and support. Shape um, is essential in order, in order for you to maintain your posture and also support in maintaining um, the muscles within your body. It is also, when we're talking about healthy, active lifestyles, when we talk about uh, our posture, making sure that we remain uh, upright and no curvature in the spine um, is essential. But also when we're talking about different sporting examples, we might talk about the posture of a prop when he's about to um, engage in the scrum within rugby. Um, also, blood cell production, essential, um, which occurs within the bone marrow. Blood cell production is essential within performers. When we talk about aerobic exercise, when we talk about our capacity to exercise for long periods of time, it's important that we're able to supply red blood cells um, effectively to the body. Okay, So in terms of uh, blood cell production, again, uh, along with the transportation of minerals through the bloodstream, this is again uh, essential. Protection. Um, so protection, um, generally, in terms of our healthy active lifestyle, if we were to fall off our bike to ensure that our body is protected and that we land comfortably, obviously we've got the added padding of the muscle tissue um, covering the bones, but also when we talk about a sporting context, if I'm heading a ball, for example, my cranium protects my brain. And if I'm making a tackle in rugby, my rib cage protects my heart and my lungs, my vital organs. Um, we then speak about the importance of mineral store, um, making sure that the important minerals are stored within, um, again, within the marrow, which, which protects us from illness, from injury, and also um, ensure that the skeletal system is strong and fibrous through the calcium that we take on board within our food. Um, and then the final one um, is movement and leverage. So movement occurring in or around the different types of joints, the hinge joint in the knee or the elbow, the ball and socket joint in the shoulder and the hip. So movements that occur, for example, when we are bowling in cricket, the range of movement that is occurring at the levers here, or think of a basketballer, the movement and the leverage required to jump and slam dunk a ball, they all are, form the basis of an effective skeletal system. Thank you.